Um, I think it's really, really fun, and I love seeing how the community will show up and support each other. And you know what? Everyone's always willing to listen. So even if they're not necessarily going to donate, just listening and hearing about it, I think it's really worth it. Are you having fun? I'm having so much fun. fun. I'm really, really tired because that was the end, but I'm having so much fun. Oh, fabulous. Wonderful. So I, I was saying that I was always like a cheerleader. And I didn't necessarily love the other cheerleaders. Like, I love cheerleading, and I never really liked cheerleaders. And I think that messed with me a little bit because I realized I can be the person I want to be and still do the things I like, and that is not necessarily tied to a group of men. However, I ended up growing up and coaching cheerleading at the same high school I went to for 10 years. And I think part of that was because I wanted to foster this group of people who also felt comfortable in their identities and felt comfortable doing what they needed to. So, you know, we campaigned for our first male cheerleader at the high school and he got to go through, you know, all of high school doing something he really loved. And I think at the end of the day, cheerleading is there to foster those identities and foster something that they love. And it's not about the people. So I think I was wrong when I was younger to include cheerleaders because they were still people with their own identities and their own struggles. And what I love about cheerleading is that it is accessible to people and that you get to show your personality in so many ways and be part of a group and you're still an individual. Like what other sport do you really get to do that? You know, in soccer, you score a goal, you score a goal. Everyone sees your name, your team gets the point. It's just not the same thing as working together and being proud of yourself as an individual. Um, and now that I'm on Cheer Us Up, my identity is kind of interesting because I do identify cis, straight, all these sorts of things. I am female, I guess that like, puts me in a minority category. But I'm like learning a lot, you know, I'm learning a lot and I'm still open to so many things and this is a community I have always loved and always been a part of, but now I feel like I'm doing something. I'm being an ally in as much of a way as I can and in the way that I really love. Sorry, yeah. Sunset with a wedgie is awful. Thank you. It's the most important interview I needed. At least you know everything's in there. A donation to PCA can help advance charitable cheerleading worldwide.